Well, hello, and welcome back to the backlog, and welcome to the edge of Allegoria. This is supposed to be a retro romp through Game Boy RPGs of old. So everybody pull out your, your Pokemon and your Dragon Warrior bingo cards, and let's see how many bingos we can get. Let's dive in. A long, long time ago, when the world was new, a whole bunch of stuff happened. It was pretty intense. Everyone was really impressed. That didn't last long, though, and eventually people just started doing their own thing. Everything got pretty boring after that. This is where you come in. Things are about to get mildly interesting. And all because some random nobody decided it was time to try something new. Don't get too excited, though. This story really isn't as impressive as the creation of the world and everything in it. That was way cooler than anything you could ever do. Now, go make a name for yourself. Like, I mean, literally. Do we have the old control scheme? Yes, there we go, everybody. On your NES bingo cards, if you've got terrible control scheme, scheme you can just go ahead and fill that square in are you sure you want to name yourself Loggy? Yes, I am. Now you need to name for your, uh, for your best friend. <sighs> no, we're not doing Jude. Hazel. Oh, no, it's, um, mm, uh, Captain. Sir Bark. Are you sure you want to name your name? Yes, uh, be a good dog, Sir Bark. And take good care of Loki. You look like you've got your work cut out for you, Loki. You're in trouble. Oh, and here we are. Loggy opened the fridge. There are some condiments and expired milk inside. That's pretty much pathetic, even for you. It's a sink. <laughs> Did you think it was something special? Okay. Gonna be good times. Loggy opened the chest, equipped the bandana. There's some writing on the tag. You can master the bandana by taking hits in battle. Once the bandana is mastered, the stat boost it provides will be permanently added to your base stats. Warning! All incomplete mastery will be lost if you fall in battle. Wash with similar colors and cold water. Do not bleach. <laughs> it's a book about fishing. When something in the caves can't go camp cold, don't want to catch anything. All right, let's go do something new. Yeah, there's no point uh, trying to fish if I don't have a fishing rod. I mean, fair enough. Try to get past these people without starting up. Check the mailbox. Well, I'll be. It looks like you could fit a mail fit mail in there. <laughs> Sabak is sleeping in the middle of the path. Would you like to pet Sabak? Oh yes. <gasps> Who's a good puppy? Who's a good puppy? Went back to sleep. Yeah. So we can't go that direction because we haven't done the tutorial yet. Of course. Got to come over here to this house and rob this house blind. Open the fridge. Yep, that sure is a fridge, all right. <laughs> no, 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 the valuables are over here in this chest. Open the chest, found a dino nuggy. Oh, lots of information. Status effect potency determines how likely are to infect. Okay, this is just all about the stats. Yes, we know about stats. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, game. I've played an RPG. But why would I be playing an allegorical RPG about RPGs? Logie, how's it going, dude? I'll just finish fixing your fishing rod for you. Ah, oh, now we can go fishing. Now you can totally fish whenever you want. You might need to master it again, though. Just go beat up a rabbit or something, and I'm sure you'll get the hang of it. Beat up a rabbit? And you can use its strike skill, even if you have something different equipped. Just don't get knocked around too hard like you did last time. You tried to master something. You got so messed up, you lost all the unfinished progress you made and had to start mastering it all over again. 
<laughs> so the, the dog saved us. Okay. All right, so we do have to go fishing first before they'll let us out of the tutorial area. So let's go fishing. Oh, there's a bite. Log, you fished up? Another empty hook. Who am I kidding? There haven't been any fish in this pond for years. Maybe it's time I finally do something with my life. <sighs> What's the worst that could happen? Oh, I assure you. Did you know there are real life monsters outside of towns? I read all about it in a book. My mummy says I can learn everything you need to know from books. She says that it, it, it isn't safe to leave the town, so I'll stay home and read. I wish she'd let me leave, though. My books taught me everything I need to know so I can be safe. There are lots of books in my house if you want to read them, too. Oh, yeah. What are you looking at, you useless waste of space? Have you finally given up on trying to catch anything in that empty pond of yours? Why don't you actually go do something with your life instead of being a lazy... <laughs> good for nothing. Yes, okay. Very good, very good. Everybody hates us. We should go do something. <laughs> Hopelessness and despair. <laughs> oh, my. So, apparently... Oh, here we go. Our pumper has gotten out of the way. Come on, Sir Bark. Let's go. Leaving the first town. <gasps> we can walk around in the tall grass. Dum, 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 da, dum, dum, da, dum. Okay. <gasps> it's a squirrel. Well, 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 it's a level one squirrel. It shouldn't take long. <laughs> Strike. Oh, ow. Get him! So I'm the Pokemon that can learn things if I master them. Loggy gained 10 experience points. Loggy leveled up. Mastered the fishing rod. Mastered the bandana. <laughs> A small bone. Oh, fun. Great. Do you want to battle me? Is that what we're doing? You there. You look like the type that would be going on a journey. It's a big world out there and it's easy to get lost. You look like the type that would carry a map, though. <laughs> of course, you might find you're using it a lot. But you look like the type that would register a shortcut on the menu with the hotkey. Keep an eye out for treasures along the way, too. You look like the type that would stray off the path to explore. There are lots of creatures that are ready to jump out at you, though. But you look like the type that could hold your own in battle. And don't worry if you forget what attacks or items do in a fight. You look like the type that would press the menu button for more information. Well, have a safe journey. You look like the type that would have a great day. <laughs> okay. New NPC unlocked. Would you look? Would you look at that? I found some honey. Delicious. I'm I'm drinking tea. How did the game know I needed a little bit of honey? <gasps> a bird. We've mastered strike. This ought to be easy. Oh, and we got a black feather. Okay, so every time we defeat something, we get, instead of, you know, being able to capture the thing, we could get the parts of the thing. So it's like monster, monster hunter, monster, monster hunter Pokemon. Rabbit. Just keep hoarding items. You might need them later. Ha <laughs> ha! Nah. That's great. Hey, we leveled up again. We found a tough to fur. Now we got one of each. Oh, 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 another one. What is it? Oh, that's not a chest. Uh oh, it's a mimic. All right, everybody, if you had mimic on your uh, bingo cards, you got a free square. Oh, I, I got punished. Come on, one more in your toast, buddy. That's right. 
That's right. Critical hit on the last hit, of course. Oh, so I can recover experience points just in the middle of the battle. A mimic tongue. Very good. When the game knows that what you really want is not loot, but another battle. Another crow, here we go. Take him out. Oh, we are getting so strong. Oh, he took to the sky, oh no. Bloodlust, bloodlust, bloodlust. What's the sign say? Route one, west, Primshire, east, Second town. <laughs> Route three. <laughs> Welcome everyone to the second town. <laughs> Stupid, I love it. This town is falling apart. There's a band of goblins that lives just north of here, and they keep sneaking in at night and stealing all of our stuff. If only there was someone, they could stop them. Do I sense a side quest? Oh, customer. How may I help you today? Ah, uh, let's sell junk. Should I getting all that junk off your hands? How does 350 for the lot of it sell? Yes, please. Thank you. All right, weapons and equipment. Leather boots. Cost 150. Traveler's hood cost 150. Warm gloves cost 150. Everything's 150. So we don't have, like... What, what do we have? Hold on. A menu option shortcut has not been registered. Oh, snap. Oh, there we are. Ma'am. Oh, there we are. This is a nice big, this is a nice big um, uh, map going on here. Cool. Cool. All right, beast jury. Oh, we haven't come across the first one. That's probably the fish. Third one and the fifth one are also a mystery, but we got a couple of crows. Oh man. Gear. Yeah, what do we got? We got a fishing rod. We should also have a bandana. And a fishing rod. That's all we have? Yeah, okay. So everything we buy is gonna be good. Ah, uh, what about a weapon? Woodcutter's axe. Oh. Weapon skill information. Doubles chances of a critical hit to opponents with mad. Deals an extra damage to enemies with blood. And a folding razor. Chance to inflict, inflict blood. Okay, I see how this works. Ooh, we found some jelly. We'll put that with our honey and make some amazing sandwiches. Oh, we need bread, though. A waffle. Okay, never mind. We've got it. Waffle, jelly, honey... A fox. All right, let's get this over with. Realistically, how often do you think you'll use this option? <laughs> I love it. Steeler's wheel. Okay, so we have strike still because we mastered the thing. Oh. Oh, no. And he's bleeding. Fox juice bite. Get him! Get him! <laughs> oh, a small bone. Good. Can I go through here? No. Okay. Because there is a tall tree to the left of me, I can't go forward. Makes perfect sense. Oh, more honey. So sweet and delicious. Kill him! Take him down! A squirrel tail. I thought I got a small bone from him last time. <gasps> Buddy? My dude? Pets or bark? No. No, no pets for you, Sir Bark. 
if you're going to be in the way and demand that I go up against these goblins. Whoa, one hit. Toasted. Oh, we mastered the folding razor. Yay. Okay, so that means now we can go into gear and equip the hatchet. Folding razor curtain equipped. Yes, hatchet. Okay, so this is attack four, potato two. Zero crit and zero sp ah. Okay. Cool. So now we can use the thing to cause the bleed and then use the hatchet to do extra damage to those who are bleeding. Love it. So much maple syrup and jelly and jam and waffles. Um, so we can do a Steeler's Wheel. Nope, okay, that was great. We are one hit killing the level ones now. Just walking through them. What a pleasure. What, why are there all these beautiful chests around here, everyone? Oh, this is a mimic. Yeah, it's a mimic. Because how else are we supposed to get that other chest there? Hack should work. Oh, life drain. Oh, no. Hack should work really well on the mimic since it's made out of wood. A mimic tongue. Ew. Mushrooms. Oh no, I don't know strength. These rocks over there look like they could be broken by something. None of my tools have worked though. Perhaps some kind of magic would be able to break them. Yeah, perhaps, perhaps. Route two, South Secondton. Route three, Route eight. Beware, goblin sightings have been reported in the area. Yes, yes, give me a challenge. There we go. Let's do Steeler's Wheel. Get him bleeding. Yes. Oh, I've been bludgeoned. Oh, a second time. And now we use Hack. It does extra damage. It's super effective. Huge damage. I mastered the leather boots. And I found a small fang. Cool. All right. So I mastered the level. There's a gear. So now I can put on the. Uh, was currently equipped. Would you like to swap it for the warm gloves? Yes. Okay. So that's kind of weird. Because this is mastered. Now its defense and speed are added to myself. Oh. 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 Our first level two. Yeah. Get him bleeding. Now he's gonna bludgeon me. Oh, beat down. Oh, snap. So we can do the same thing and still take him out, but let's use hack so we can do massive damage. Yes. Small, found a small thing. I still haven't mastered the, uh, oh, guys, what are you doing? I should have tried to master more gear before going into that dungeon. <laughs> Only have a couple skills under my belt, but clearly they weren't enough. Sure, if I'd mastered a couple more, I would have been fine. I heard you can pull off combos by stringing a few skills together. That would definitely make short work of this piece of goblins. Whoa, 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 what are you doing here? It isn't safe. I tried to get back at the goblins for all the stuff they've been pulling, but there's too many of them. My goblin king ain't someone to mess with either. He started going on about his people are suffering. Of course, we're gonna kill them. They're monsters. And why should we share this land with them? They're uncivilized savages that live in a hole in the ground. There's no reason they can't just go find another one. I can't stop you from going in there, but if you do, wipe them all out like the scum they are. 
Oh, we're racists. Ah, yes. The allegory begins, everyone. The allegory begins. Uh, can I pillage the bones since I am monster? Hmm. Okay, so I can't go through any of that. Ooh, a long sword. The hatchet is currently equipped. Would you like to swap it for the long sword? Oh, hatchet master is at 100%. Oh, yeah. Yep. Cool. Oh, started feeling stiff. Agility and potency are reduced. Oh, still feeling stiff. Oh, man. Yeah, let's kill him. <laughs> oh, we mastered the warm gloves. Oh, oh, so we're still stiff. Okay. A bottle of alcohol. Oh man, how does, uh, how long does this last? Is this like a poison or is it wear off at some point? Do I need to use the antidote? What else going on here? I don't really want to go into the fight with stuff going on. Uh, let's see here. Items. Dino Nuggy. Heals 20 HP. Honey heals 10, 10, 10, 20, 10. Mushroom heals HP, but inflicts the madness effect. Drumstick. Sandwich. Cure poisoning. A poison effect. <laughs> heals 50% HP. Okay. Well, I guess we're, we're stuck with this for now. Oh, look. Another human. You all think you can just take what you want and leave nothing for the rest of us. You rape the land and hoard its resources and expect everyone to just accept it? And then you have the audacity to complain when someone does the same to you? We were here first, you entitled jerks. That being said, there's something different about you, isn't there? You're not like the rest of them. You're much worse. And yes, I see it now. Foolishly going through the motions, ignorant of the consequences of your actions, blinded by your desire to make something of yourself. You reek of wasted potential. I suppose you fancy yourself as some kind of a hero as well. But to whom are you a hero? The first bunch of jerks with a problem they can't solve themselves? You're no hero. You're an aimless little jerk taking directions from narcissistic jerks. A puppet. Once I'm through with you, we're going to that village of yours and killing every last one of you. You'll suffer as we have for so long. It's time you humans finally get what's coming to you. Look at this Goblin King trying to look all tough and stuff. Time to mess his day up. Violence is always the answer. <laughs> oh, oh, reckless charge. Ew. Goblin King was damaged by the recoil. Hit him with Steeler's Wheel. Oh, he's not, um... He's not bleeding. Uh, should we use, let's see, honey, no, maple syrup, what was it, waffle? Use the waffle. Eagle strike. Ew. Oh, I've been flailed. Oh, multiple times. Sequentially. Come on, make a bleed. Ah, we're stiffened still. Okay, item. Use the cheese. Oh, there was only 10 e Oh, no. Wait, which one? Which one is drumstick? Yes, use the drumstick. Oh, good. Oh, we're back. Should I do fearsome blow? Ow, you slam. Yes, now he's more susceptible to bleeding. Fight. Now we can use Steeler's Wheel. Ow. Hopefully get him bleeding. Yes, now he's bleeding. Now we can use Hack. Uh, but let's use Dino Nuggies. Eat the Dino Nuggies. Yes. Slam. Ah, he missed. Still bleeding. Now we use Hack. Ow. 
which does huge damage, takes him out. Lead attack bonus. Goblin King took huge damage. Ooh, and we leveled up. Oh, and we have the Goblin King's head. Hello? It's the swirling essence of the Goblin King. Would you like to touch it? Oh, yes. As you touch the Goblin King's essence, visions of his past consume your mind. You see a young goblin kneeling before a mysterious shadowy figure. A deal is struck, and the goblin is made into a king in exchange for his loyalty to the ominous darkness. The king's compassion for his people finally allows them to prosper unlike ever before. Oh man, that was some weird stuff. What was that huge shadow thing? I don't know. Good job, Bobby. Sir Bark has decided to help make travel a lot faster. <laughs> Just open the map and pick a location you've been to and Sir Bark will take you there. <laughs> go puppy, go puppy. He's a good dog. He'll be with you through thick and thin. Yes, he will. Yes, he will. Okay, so we've been here. We can go here. Ha <laughs> ha. Let's sell junk. Route 9. Sakenton. Route 16. All scholarly travelers are advised to take extra precautions. And unscholarly ones are what? Hey man, how's it going? Sorry about blocking the path, but I just couldn't let this inspiration get away from me. I just go where the wind takes me, you know? You have to come back later. Yes, because I can't make it through the music. It's too much of a bop. <laughs> what? A fawn? Let's begin as we always do. With our two-part... Oh, trample. I've been trampled. With our two-part huge damage combo. Bye-bye. Maybe I'll find another goblin heart. Oh, bacon. Let the meal continue. <gasps> I found the Necronomicon. The longsword is currently equipped. Yes, I'd like to swap for the Necronomicon. What on earth does the Necronomicon do? Life drain? Ooh. Interesting. <laughs> Life drain effect heals 50% of damage inflicted. Oh, cool. Oh, a level five wolf. Okay. Let's see if he bleeds. How oh, I've been chomped. How much damage does this do? Oh, that did a lot of damage, actually. That did a pretty good amount of damage. And healed me. Yeah, this ought to take him out. Heal me back up a little. Yes! Okay, cool. Oh, here it is. Secondton. The scholarly travels are advised to, to take extra precautions. Yes, yes, indeed. Looks, looks like it can be broken. But I don't have the ability. It's around here somewhere. So, you can see, this is sort of the, uh... The, the allegory, I'm sure, will run very shallow. Just like the writing has run as well. If you're interested in RPGs, if, if you played these back in the day, and, and you want to subvert your nostalgia for them, maybe check out The Edge of Allegoria. And uh, if you want to see some more, let me know down in the comments and we'll play some more here on the channel. Yeah, but until I've then, play something else here on the backlog. I'll play it again later. Oh, backlog, oh, backlog. With a controller in his hand, he dives into the digital in world so vast and grand. And every quest shall see its end, every legend sung, for backlog 
fights the endless fight where all his games are done. He ventured deep in dungeons dark and spaces void of light. With every foe he vanquished there, he watched those years roll by. In cities quaint and barren lands, no quest was left to waste. He swore he'd conquer everyone before he grew too old.